Howdy doody everybody, it's Nintendo Capri Sun welcoming you back to Let's Play Majora's Mask. I'm standing here amongst Zora's Zora Company. He says, hey Macau, you want to do that thing you used to always do? Well, this would be a good chance to show you another one of the moves you can do as a Zora, which is to break these uh, pots. And this is the closest thing to a boomerang you're going to get in this game, so might as well enjoy it. You want to aim for that middle pot there, we'll shoot out two of them. And this is really, you got to have like just the right distance. Um, yeah. And if you don't break them all, he takes 10 rupees away from you. But even if you don't have any rupees on you, you can still do it, and he'll just not take away any at all. And, you know, he won't, like, say that you owe them 10 rupees or anything. Well, damn it. Well, there we go. That's how it's done. Way to go, Macau. You've got a big smirk on your face. Well, here's a hundred rupees, except Jar replacement counts ten rupees, so I'll have to deduct that. You get ninety rupees. Take the challenge again sometime. As you can see, I only have ninety-eight rupees because I missed so much that I lost all my rupees. So let's head back to, or should I say I'm going to head, I don't know why I say let's head back, like like you're doing this with me, like I'm your teacher or something. But I don't know, it's kind of, well it is let's play, so it's kind of like, yeah, let's do this, I, I guess. See, I really don't like this shallow area of the water here. It's kind of hard to stay in the water when you're doing this. Shoot, there's something crawling on my foot. Dang it. Okay, so you come over here and there's little fishy, 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 fishy. Stop that! There's fishy fishies in the water. And lucky thing I actually have four empty bottles here. Well, I can't. <laughs> no, not as a Zora, I can't. Anyway, you can catch these in the bottles. Is this okay, mommy? Let's catch another one. Okay, I don't have my big Poe anymore, but that's okay. I don't want it. I'm actually glad that I lost it so I can do these all at once. Because you need four fish. I've actually heard in some areas, I, some people say you need six. I'm not sure, but I'm going to go ahead and just get four. Is this okay, mommy? Yeah, I need to make sure and uh, put that picture in this video. This Batman9502 sent me a picture of a t-shirt that says that on it, and it's so funny. I just cracked up the first time I saw it. Couldn't believe that. Makes me wonder if I put it on Cafe Press. Like, could I sell that? <laughs> wonder how much I'd sell. I actually do have a Cafe Press account. I got a mug on there. Um, but I don't know if I've even... I haven't even checked it to see if I've like sold any. I don't know. I probably haven't. I pimped the mug on my other channel a long time ago, but I never... Uh, where am I going with these? Oh, that's right. We're going back out here to the other beach. Yeah, I think I'm going to just take off my mask here. There, this will get us there a little quicker. Yeah, there's just so many side quests in this game. Most people will tell you that Majora's Mask is about 90% side quests and 10% story. So anyway, come to this house over here. The other one is the spider house. And there's actually more you can do here later, but talk to him. He says, I've been catching fish in these seas for 30 years. When it comes to catching fish, I'm even better than the Zoras. That's what I'd like to be saying anyway. Lately, the seawater's gotten really warm. It hasn't helped my fishing at all. And what's worse, this water has gotten murky, so when I ship out, I always lose my way and somehow end up back ashore. Yeah, I've been there, done that. Anyway, there should be an aquarium in here. Now, I've never I've never actually done this before, so I might be being stupid. Is this the aquarium? Um, no, don't dump it on the ground, please. Oh my god, why are you doing that? No, no, no. Pick it back up. Okay, good. Oh god. Is this okay, Mommy? Alright, let's see. Do I have to get on top of the aquarium to dump it in there? And when I read that on the walkthrough, I thought, okay, that's what's going to trip me up, is how do we get the fish in the aquarium? Maybe you have to... Well, you can talk to him about the seahorse. Take him back to the waters near Pinnacle Rock. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is. Now, this is important later on. You don't have to do this now. But you'll find out later on that you have to, but... Um, oh, pictograph of the female pirates, that's right. You do have to go there. But anyway, yeah, and this took me forever to figure out, because I didn't think to talk to the seahorse. 
Let me see if I can do that thing where you jump on the platform from underwater. That's really hard to do because you gotta judge your distance just right. Yeah, that was good. Alright. That helps a lot if you can do that during the boss battle at the temple. But I can never do it. It's just... It's largely luck-based, I think. Yeah, see, here's an aquarium. Well, here's another aquarium here. Maybe this is the one they're talking about. Let's try it. Drop the fish inside. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, they ate him! Oh, No one, he got bigger, though. Oh, but that's so mean. But, I gotta do this to get my piece of heart, so I guess I just have to be mean, then. Oh, well, it looks like he's... Wait, is he gonna do it? Holy crap! That thing's humongous! Well, there you go. Well, there's another piece of heart. Nice. Okay. Well, I'm sure glad that's over. I was a little worried about that. I was in there trying to dump it in the aquarium with a seahorse in it. Oh my god. Anyway, so I think it's time we made some progress here on the storyline. We've pretty much done most everything that we can do here. So what you're going to do is go north on the map here. You can see in the upper right corner there's a little um, exit way. They have a word for that when it's like an entryway, but they don't have a word for exit way. Well, I guess you would call it an entryway either way, because you could enter from another area to this area. Anyway, that's where we're headed. It's going to be blocked off. There's going to be several wood blockages down here. None of them have anything inside of them except for this one. So you just break it and dive. And go in. Go inside. Pirate's Fortress. So you come in here, and holy moly, they're on the boat. They're on a boat! You know, I still haven't heard that song. I heard, like, a part of it one day, and it was, like, kind of good. And I remember thinking, like, it was mostly, like, screaming or something. But then I heard part of it one day, and there was, like, a melody to it. So it's like, okay, so does it have a melody, or is it all screaming? Or maybe it's, like, a little bit of both. Whoa. Yeah, when you see those fishes coming at you, you should press the R button really quickly. Otherwise, they just bite you, and it's really hard to fight them. It is such a pain in the ass. Yeah, see, like that. Piece of cake. Those guys gave me so much trouble, I wish I'd figured that out sooner. That's actually yet another thing that I learned from Uzumachi, and I just ignored that one again. Whoa, whoa, stay down, stay down. Stay down, stay down, stay down. You don't want to get caught. See, he's right there on the boat. So, just wait for them to go by. You can see them on the map, little white dots going around in a circle down there. So, and there's also a treasure chests at the bottom of the sea here, but they're mostly rupees, so don't bother. I did slow the time down, right? I don't know why in the world it's 3 in the afternoon. Well, that's how long I spent messing around trying to put the fish in that seahorse aquarium like a dumbass. Okay, that was a lucky thing I had all those bottles. Maybe I should have caught some more fish. Uh, can I put something else? Uh, what am I going to need? Oh, I'll just put the ocarina there. Anyway, we'll put the Zora, or the Goron mask on, on top of the Zora in a second here. <laughs> now that looks funny right there, man. Oh, God. So, no curl. Thank you. And that opens up a doorway! A secret passage! Anyway. No, I know that was probably no better. That might have been a little better. Okay, so then you gotta turn into a Zora again. You can probably jump down here and not get seen. Just stay underwater. So that secret passage is actually way the heck down here. On the opposite end. Mm -hmm. See ya, fish. God, I love the electricity. It's the greatest thing that ever happened to the Zora. I mean, all the other Zora weapons are pretty much too slow for my taste, so... But I like the electricity. It's instant. You know, and you make contact and you just win. It's total win. It's made of pure win. So then we're gonna have to break some more of these, uh... Well, pfft. More of these, uh, boulders here. And then you're gonna have to... You're gonna have to get used to diving and surfacing a lot, because you're gonna be doing it quite a bit. So we're going to pull this block here, and that's all you want to do there. Then we head over here, break this, break that. I'm actually pretty bad at controlling this Zora. If it seems like I'm doing anywhere near decent, it's a complete accident if I am. So anyway, walk around here, and this is why you wanted to pull that other block instead of pushing it. Because if you pushed it, well, you wouldn't have gotten anywhere. You would have just gone backwards. You know, in the bathroom! Anyway, here we go. So head on up here. And now there's gonna be, um, well, 
I'm gonna take it kind of slow here because there's like a, a thing there, a little current going across the top, and you can actually pop these if you want, use your boomerang, so just to get them out of the way. Or, well, if two of them touch each other, I think they explode anyway, just go under the current here. Otherwise, it'll warp you back out to the main area where the boats are. So you don't really want that. So just take it easy, it's not too hard of an area. What time are we looking at here? 13.36. I think I'll go a couple more rooms, we're gonna have to stop here. We got a piece of heart coming up here pretty soon too, so then we'll have 12 heart containers, which will be nice. What are we doing in here now? Okay, this is just that. Yeah, this is the room right here, isn't it? The one with the heart piece? I do believe it is! And the heart piece is in there, but how will we get it? Find out next time on Let's Play Majora's Mask, and stop riffing off H.C. Bailey. See you later.